Hi, my name is Leticia Huckabee, and I am an artist that works mostly with photography, but I have been printing my images onto fabric and layering in vintage and heirloom pieces into the work. And I'm so honored to be here to talk about the work of Betty Saar, because she's a huge influence on what I do. Um, I think that she really influences me in two ways. One, through her art, how she's able to speak to the politics of today, but from a feminine perspective. I love how she relates things from the past to things that are going on contemporary time, in contemporary times. It's what I really try to focus on in the work that I do. I love how um, we can layer in and have these conversations with either ancestors who's come before us or experiences um, and all the things that are going on right now. For the show that's here at the Nasher, the piece that really speaks to me the most is the I will bend but I will not break. Just this quietness of it, but the power behind that piece just hits me in the gut to see it. Um, the idea that she took this vintage ironing board and printed an image of a, the cargo hull of a slave ship on the top of it, and then this pristine white sheet with the embroidery on it is just dynamic to me and is exactly the, the type of feel that I go for in the work that I create. I often describe it as sort of a quiet punch. I like for my work to be beautiful and engaging to draw the, the viewer in, but then when they get there, they get really hit with history and realities and all these different things. And then the second thing that really inspires me about Betty is that she was unapologetically a mother and an artist. And like her, I have three children. Only difference is I do have one son and she had all, all girls. But uh, I heard her say once in an interview that there was no difference between the two, that being an artist and being a mother are the same thing. And I often get questions about how do I balance uh, the two jobs, the two um, aspects of my life. And, and it was so, um, refreshing to hear her talk about that because it is pretty much the same you know it takes creativity it takes time and patience and a commitment and love all the same things that we put into our artwork we put into our children so she's really inspiring to me in um, in those two ways and thank you